In this video, I'm gonna take you through the awesome new SaaS Light feature, which is available on the Freelancer or the Agency Unlimited plan. That's the standard plan that a lot of people, if you're not doing SaaS, are on. Basically, if you run an agency, but you're not doing SaaS, you're on. Well, this is a really, really important feature for you. And at, you know, let's be honest, it's to encourage you to jump, uh, it's to give you a taster and some of the features of the SaaS plan to encourage you to jump uh, um, to the SaaS plan, but it's great that High Level are releasing some of these extra features for people that aren't on the SaaS plan. So let's look at it. I'm gonna take you through it. I'm gonna show you how it works. I'm gonna show you inside our own High Level account, um, some of the things that we've got there uh, and go from there. Now, if this is useful, do me a favor, smash the like button, drop a comment, Share the video, all of that good stuff. It would mean the world to me. Thank you very much. Okay, let me just move my head a little bit out of the way. So I'm here actually in High Levels Help Doc. I'm gonna take you through the Help Doc. I'm gonna show you inside um, our account as well so you can see what this is, where it is, how it's working. Okay, so let me just explain about what this does. This is rebilling for, right now it's on the phone system, but email is coming, they're gonna add email, so that they're, they're building out what they're calling this SaaS Lite package. This is the first step in this direction um, for SaaS Lite package. Look, they've even um, put a tag here of SaaS mode um, for this. So what this does is this allows you, instead of, uh, uh, if you're an, and an agency, you're bringing clients on, but you're not on the full SaaS package, you can rebuild the phone costs. And so before, either what you had to do was basically go and get them the Twilio account of their own and all the hassle of that, uh, um, and then come and manually put all of that in, or you just basically ate the cost of the phone usage. And if you have clients that only spend a small amount, don't do very much, it's not the end of the world. And if you're maybe charging them 1500 bucks for ads and they spend, 50 bucks on phone costs, not the end of the world. But this starts to eat up, and particularly if you have high volume, bigger bigger clients uh, um, there, and you were having to eat, eat those costs. And in fact, when we jumped to SaaS mode, one client that we were eating the costs of paid the difference for our upgrade for us. So the rebilling uh, is really important, uh, and being able to, on the SaaS plan, mark up that rebilling that nobody questions is just an accepted business practice. Um, is awesome. But if you're not jumping up and you want to do this SaaS light, here's what it is, here's how you can do it. You can now recover the costs. You can now recover the costs of all these phone calls and it doesn't cost you anything extra to do this, so why would you not? So it runs in the same way that the SaaS rebilling uh, runs within uh, high level on the pro plan. The just the bit that's missing, um, the bit that you don't see is, is, is you just can't mark it up, that's all. Um, now, you've got to run it on the lead connector phone system. That's the other exception on, on SaaS plan you can run on, on Twilio as well. You've got to be using the lead connector phone system. That's how the integration works. And honestly, you know, they want to bring everything um, in, in-house. So I think that's, that's why they're pushing that out. So you've got to run it on there. But um, look, this is, a, this is the key bit here. Let me show you this. Uh, the lead connector phone system basically uh, is 10% cheaper than Twilio. They run through Twilio, but big, they basically get a volume discount. So they get the volume discount. So, um, so hey, you actually save some money by running running cheaper um, than anyway, and you save your clients um, some some money. So, um, on every account, you, uh, every sub account that you're running this on, you must have someone who's an admin. Um, now, I don't mean an agency admin. I mean at the sub account level. But why is that? Because you, in order to manage the payment method, when we come into company billing which is an essential part of, of this. You know, basically your client's gonna put their credit card down to pay for this rebilling. So in order to do that, they have to be um, a given admin level in order to manage the financial aspects with, within it. So if you get stuck turning it on and can't do it, make sure that whatever user is in there, at least one of them is an admin level in order to do it. So you're just gonna come uh, um, and, 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 and check how do you know if it's on. There's a, there's a little diagram here that will tell you, look, if this icon is red, then rebilling is active. Uh, um, rebilling can be enabled. Um, there's a, a little icon there, and and rebilling can cannot be enabled. And basically, why would rebilling not not be able to be enabled? Um, because it's not on Lead Connector; it's on a Twilio um, phone phone system. And actually, they make this whole. Uh, we have this in our account as well. They they, they make these bits green. You can just see if it, if it's green, it's basically Lead Lead Connector, and you and and you can do it. Um, um, there's a whole help article on moving to Lead Connect the phone system. It's actually pretty simple. It, it takes takes a, f a 
few clicks, they do some stuff in the background, come back the next day and boom, and they move everything over. You don't lose your phone numbers or anything like that. They just move it all over. They, 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 they pulled it all over. So when you're just gonna come in here, you're gonna click to an, to an enable rebuilding. You, you, you're gonna click that icon there, and then you can basically turn it turn it on, you enable the rebuilding. And then you've got to um, add a um, payment method um, for the um, for the client there. If you already got them in Stripe, um, you can just do that. You can, you can send them an, an SMS or anything like that. Um, but we can also go to the company billing page, which is at the location level, um, you go to settings company billing so you can see it over here so this is a, a company billing aspect that's um, what we're familiar with on the SaaS plan um, now we're seeing this on the on the agency or the the, the freelancer plan where they can come in and, and add their payment method once they've added their payment method in there um, that's going to en enable the the rebilling now the the default markup is set to 1.05 meaning a five percent markup why is that that's um, set to cover your Stripe charges. You see, you don't actually want to lose money from this. Stripe's going to charge you a fee for processing this, so you so you mark it up that 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 tiny bit. But your client still saves money because you're getting a 10% discount on the Twilio fees anyway. So even though you're marking up a tiny bit, but 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 that's all um, you can mark up because you're not on the on the SaaS plan. So how does it work? Basically, it works with a wallet system. And when the email gets rolled out, this will roll out into the same wallet system. Your client puts money, basically, and it, it auto charges, for example, 10 bucks into their wallet. They then make phone calls, they text, um, that, that kind of thing. You collect it as an agency and then high level um, bill you. Um, so they're gonna put 10 bucks into into, into their wallet, so your agency is going to bill them 10 bucks. You actually got now sat in your Stripe account, which will then obviously go into your bank account, the 10 bucks. It will start whittling down when it gets to a preset level. It will auto charge their card and it will go again and again and again. And then high level will charge you directly. So every time you see an extra charge coming through from high level, that's it. Uh, um, that's because um, um, that balance has whittled down. I don't worry about that because your client has already paid you. So they pay ahead. They pay ahead of it. Um, so that's really, really critical. Now, when you come come into um, this, you can you, you can you, you can come and see in the in the billing here. There's a little, little tab here. You can see the credits. You can see how much they've got. These are the auto recharge parts here, uh, um, and this looks just like it does on the on the SaaS plan. You can come in and you can click here, and then you'll start to get you know itemized billing of all the different parts. So they can check their usage. You can check their 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 usage. They come and hit that that same thing and they can hit over here and see when the charges are they can see all of all of the usage you can see here that the email rebilling is um, going through so I highly recommend if you are uh, if you're a freelancer on the the uh, the freelancer plan or the agency unlimited plan two names for the same thing uh, I highly recommend that you start doing this with your clients uh, um, we don't have any problems because um, we've been doing this with with the the markup as well, um, rebilling on SaaS for quite some time now, and just people are used to paying a phone bill. We don't really get any questions, or if we do get a question, we quickly explain it. Nobody bats an eyelid, and we all move on. They used to, you know, they they used to paying for texts, for phone calls, you know, all of all of that stuff. So, um, so nobody bats an eyelid on it. So definitely do it. Recover those costs. For your agency, you know, add add more money to your bottom line. Um, get rid of some of those expenses. Essentially, um, is what you do. Now, what I will say is, I definitely recommend then um, jumping up onto the rebilling um, plan, which is basically the SaaS plan. Let me let me move my head. So this is this is inside um, our our account here. Look, we 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 do a default three X and three X here for phone and email. Remember, email is coming soon to SaaS Lite. Um, but we do we do a default 3x markup and if you recall I said at the start of this that we had one client one client who paid for the so it is honestly it's 200 200 dollars difference to go from the the agency unlimited the freelancer plan at 297 to 497 a month um, for the SaaS plan but one client paid for the difference with the rebilling and we weren't even doing 3x then I think we were doing two or two and a half um, and that one client the difference in in, in that pay for that. now imagine getting a few clients in that use the system uh, 
a, a bunch. They're going to pay for your whole high-level account every month on, the, on on their own, and then more on top of that. Let alone the money that you're making from um, from SaaS and from everything else as well. Um, so definitely, 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 highly recommend that you come and um, uh, one definitely do SaaS Lite and two just do the 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 upgrade now of course uh, um, you know I've got some uh, uh, extra to show you if you come to the profitpack.com we give you all the training all for free no scams no tricks no upsells now um, for you to um, build and scale your own SaaS business so if you are, in, you are interested then please come over to the profitpack.com come and fill out the form um, and and uh, jump over here to um, see what you get. Honestly, I am not kidding. I am not exaggerating. People have validated what I'm about to say, which is that we have the most comprehensive resources, training, snapshots, and support on the planet of everybody, and we're giving it all away for free. So please come in here. Please come check it out. If you are um, on high level already and want to upgrade to SaaS, please come do it for us. You get access to all of this. Uh, um, if you're not on high level already, again, Please come through here. We've got the we've got these free courses. We will do that, and we will show you how to get your money back um, in less than thirty days. Because in thirty days, we're going to get you more clients than it costs to pay for the software. Plus, if you go through our link, uh, um, you get a thirty day free trial instead of the standard fourteen. And if you're upgrading, you get an account credit for the difference. So if you're on the two ninety seven, you're basically going to get a two hundred dollar account credit through high level. If you're on the ninety seven, you're going to get four hundred dollar account credit. So it's the same as getting a the equivalent to getting a free trial for that period of time as well. So you know, definitely just for those reasons. But all the resources, training, and everything we do weekly Zoom rooms, not not just. Uh, um, text message support or anything like that but weekly zoom so if you get stuck we make sure we are incentivized to make sure that it works for you and answer all your questions so any questions any problems you can reach out to us please um, smash that like button on this video drop drop a comment share it uh, um, subscribe to the channel um, that would be awesome and make sure you have an awesome day